Hey guys, Lori Amos here and I am at the Jennifer M. O'Neill Community Ice Arena, also known as Reno Ice. I get a lot of questions or a lot of comments of, I cannot wait for that building to be open. My kids are dying to skate. I'm dying to get back on the ice. Like all of you, I've been wondering what's going on with the new ice skating rink. So we are here today to find out what's going on. I'm Richard Beck. I'm the general manager here at Reno Ice. So uh, we are standing now in, in phase one, which is just the one rink uh, for now. Uh, this rink is, a, is an NHL size rink. It's 200 by 85. The, the big thing our hockey director says, hockey is for everyone. And that's what we want. Reno Ice is for everyone. And we went the tax exempt way because we wanted to open it up. We wanted to di diversify as best as we could so that everybody has a chance to skate. At the moment, we are offering learn to skate classes hockey programs, a uh, little NHL program for beginning hockey players. We are not offering adult programs right now just due to the COVID restrictions. When they walk into Reno Ice, they're gonna walk into and see a pro shop. That pro shop should be here hopefully around the mid-February. Another service we're gonna have is we're gonna have a full concession, which is run by Roundabout Grill, I believe. Concessions will also offer alcohol, beer and, and, and alcohol. Phase two, is, is a second sheet and then we also build up the mezzanine where there is a, where uh, roundabout will build a, a restaurant. Up there, there'll be windows to the rink so parents can sit up there, have a cocktail, have a hamburger, watch uh, overlooking their kids playing, overlooking their kids skating or public skating. That, that's part of phase two. The roadmap for Reno Ice is pretty simple. Uh, we're going to grow hockey programs so that we have kids starting at age three or four and they're gonna stay lifelong hockey fans. Not only fans, but also playing. The other part is we're going, to co we're going to develop figure skaters. We want them to come in also at that young age and keep them figure skating as long as they can. Ice sports is like nothing else that, that I've ever experienced. I've played high school football, I've played high school soccer. High school hockey was the best thing that ever happened because it taught me team, team skills. And it just, it's just unbelievable when you get out on the ice. We had a lot of fun filming here today. We hope you enjoyed it. For more information, be sure to check out their website. Information will be below.